What's it like putting the moves on Oprah? I don't know, man. I still got some work to do. <laughs> I still got to get her. Yeah? <laughs> Think gonna, she can be got? She's going to be my wife one day. Oh, that's great. I'm telling you that. It's coming. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, you play, your character is, I think, really the only character in the film who is content, you know, who's happy the way things are, or at least, you know, that's the front of On the out there. of it, outside yeah. of it. Why do you think it's important to portray that kind of a character in the well, film? Well, because there, there's always been the passive um, side of, of, of America that felt that it was pointless to try and make change. You just need to accept what's going on. And they have been more harmful than the outright bigots because the outright bigots, you know where the, their obstacles stand at, but those passive individuals that will not choose to be on this side of the fence or on that side of the fence, all they do is, is become an anchor to a terrible way of life and they just, they suck the air out of those who will make change. And you know, Lee Daniels, this is a very mainstream film for him. And Steve McQueen is, has 12 Years a Slave, also a mainstream film. What do you think of this trend of indie filmmakers going mainstream? Well, we have to reach a larger audience or the gift that these indie filmmakers have will become um, drowned, you know, in this handrail of mediocrity and mediocrity. Um, this common, you know, what is it called that they serve you in, um, in Russia, gruel. Oh, I like that. Mm -hmm. This gruel that's being passed out and, and said to be uh, a great piece of meal, a great meal when it's really nothing at all. We need to change those ideals. We have to, they have to get out there and show the bigger picture of what artistry is and then they can go back and make their independent films again. You know, and hopefully Lee will not get caught up in this big movement and will remember that his strength and power came from making little steps that's like CISO. You know, if he had stepped out of the White House and ended up going in the streets marching, it was necessary for him at a time. But his greatest contributions were made, you know, behind the scenes.